okay, this is what we feed our puppy, grand puppy in the morning. He's right here waiting on his food. And this is what, actually, this is for us. <laughs> this is what, uh, so all the fat that, like, let's say we're cooking sausage or whatever, and fat is left, we just put it in a container and use it for for his food. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to take a piece of this. Sorry, I'm a cameraman and... So I'm going to put it in a cup, okay? I can take a little bit more. Put it in a cup, and then I'm going to warm this up for maybe something like 30 seconds, just to melt all that fat. In the meantime, I'm going to take his food. This is his food. I don't know what's mixed in here, but our daughter gives us these packets uh, to feed him with, and I'm going to pour half of it here. So we're going to put his uh, food here. Fill it up as much as he can. He's going to finish all this food. Normally, he doesn't want to eat his food that much if we don't have, you know. Um, so I'm going to grab this fat. Oh. I'm going to grab this fat and then I'm going to pour it on his food. He's already jumping up and down. And let me find a teaspoon to stir it. Just having that hint of fat actually makes him eat his food. Um, look at him waiting patiently. Good boy. And now look at him, he's chowing his food. He can smell the sausage and he's gonna be looking for it. Um, yeah, basically that's how I get him to eat his food. Otherwise his food can sit there for a long time. Him just waiting for you to give him any human food, he'll wait for that. But this way he gets to eat his food and I give him just a little bit of fat. And obviously I give him bones um, when, you know, like when he, uh, when we are eating meat. And he loves that. And that keeps him at bay while we are eating. Anyway, enjoy, Nani. Good boy. Now he finished all his food, so I'm going to give him water. Then he's going to drink and then I'm going to clean up here.